So I'm here with Melissa from the Anglo-American School in Moscow, mm -hmm. and you're showing me about the iPad and how we can do text-to-speech, which I've just found out about. And what did you tell right. me about? And I just learned about it myself too. So if you go into your settings, and uh, just in the general section, there's an accessibility link, and you go to speech, and right here you can turn on your speech selection and speak screen, and there are two different ways of using it. So, for example, if I have a uh, PDF on my iBooks, okay. I can simply use two fingers and come down from the top. Wow. And, and of course, and uh, the different, and it can read while I look at the text, so it clears off the screen. I can open it back up and yeah. change the speed. Speed switch so the turtle for slow and the uh, rabbit for fast That's speed. That's right, okay. and then if it goes to, uh, if I want to back up a little bit, I can uh, go back just a little bit at a time, back to the previous paragraph. Okay. Um, and there are some options there. You can also change the voice back in the settings and the applications if yeah. you rather have a male voice than a female voice. Uh, the other way that it works is, let's say I'm doing some research on a uh, website and have a text I want to this read great, just yeah. part this, of. This, this is great for classroom. I see kids using it on websites all the time. Right. I'm not quite sure what they mean or understand. Mm -hmm. Right. So I can just select the part okay. that I want to look at a paragraph at a time and use that to speak. That's brilliant. Isn't that great? Yeah. So that's I think that's going to be really helpful, especially for my kids who resist reading. Yes, definitely. I'm, I'm, I'm going to use that in my classroom next week. Definitely. Thanks a lot, Miss. That was brilliant.